Hi everyone, my name is Allie and welcome to my channel, Allie's Craft Creations. Um, so this is the first time I'm showing my face if you already subscribed to me. It's really exciting. But today's video is DIY birthday gifts. And on my other channel, which I just made like two days ago, um, is about um, like kind of a joke, but not really. It's kind of a skit thing and I love to edit videos and I like to make movies. So that is a perfect channel to put all my skits and funny things I want to put on. So yeah, my other channel is called The Creative Square, so it kind of goes with the Ally's Craft Creations kind of thing, like creative and creations. Um, but that's just more of a general channel I can post anything on. And so if you would like to subscribe to that channel, just subscribe right over there, please. So let's get started. So the first gift that I think would be really nice is a scrapbook. I made this scrapbook around last year, maybe, and um, I did a sharing session on it. You can click this box right here to watch it. And um, so, just a brief overview of this mini album. Um, the design is made by Super Happy Scrapper, and um, she originally designed this to be way bigger than this, but the size I shrunk mine down to is around like four inch, four and a half inches by five and a half inches, I believe, but I'm not very sure. But it's just around that size, and I think it's really easy to alter the inches and stuff. And so I'm just gonna flip through it really quickly. This is a really, really cute um, mini album, and I just use the stack Sunday afternoon. I don't know what design company it's by because it's been so long, but yeah. Um, I haven't made that many albums since I made this, but I still like to craft sometimes. And um, so I just love these trinkets and stuff, and I think this would be a really great gift to give to your friend or something and personalize it. I'm going to put my friend's initials on the back right here with some letters I cut out from the Cricut or just emboss it or anything you want. But yeah, so definitely personalize it to your friend's liking and I think this would be a very good present that any friend would like to receive. The second gift I want to show you, I can't really show you because, well I guess I can, but it's like a video and if you want to know what it is, go on my other channel, The Creative Square, um, and you can just click this box right here to go to it. It's kind of a, like, it just depends on how you create it. If you want it to be funny, it can be funny, but I think it's really sweet to do that and I'm doing that for my friend right now but it's really hard because uh, I have to reach friends from all over the world and yeah and people might think you're weird for asking but I think it's worth it like you can just make it for your friend and they'll really like it. Another easy present you can give them is just any book. This is my favorite book I read I think three days ago but I love it so much it's to All the Boys I Loved Before by Jenny Han. And also, if they have a sequel, you can pick it up. In this case, it's a duology, so I also read P.S. I Still Love You the next day because I'm obsessed with this series and I think this book has a lot of events. It's not just like plain and I think the concept is really awesome. So yeah, that's the third gift idea. The fourth gift idea is to just look around your room and see the products you use a lot. So in my case, since my lips are always dry, I use this Mint Juleps Lip Scrub from Lush. The next thing I love is these. I think they're mints or something, but it's rose flavored, which is really weird, but I love them and they're really good. The third thing I found was this Lavender Sleep Balm and um, since I love lavender so much, I always use this at bedtime because lavender helps you sleep. The fourth thing is this nail polish by OPI and it's in the color Planks A Lot and it's just a really cool lavender color. The fifth product is this hand cream and it's really good. It's by Savannah B and I think you could just buy it online but I don't think their scent is as good as this one because it's like kind of old 
I'm almost out of it, sadly. Sixth product is a lavender wand. Um, I think lavender wands are so great because you can smell them and it just makes your room smell really great. And if you want a tutorial on how to make this, just put it in the comments. So those are all the things I love to use in my room and just don't give them those obviously because you like them. But um, just try to find copies of it or just buy another set of it and just put it in a really cute bag and just give it to them and then I think they will love it too if you do. The next gift idea is to personalize any products. So a pillow or a guitar pick. For a guitar pick, you can just go online and um, I think there are a lot of websites that personalize guitar picks or any other special thing like if they play guitar, obviously, you can give them a guitar pick. But if they don't play guitar, you can also personalize something like a pillow. Um, so I made this pillow for Valentine's Day. It's a bit, like, <laughs> roughed up now since there's a bunch of, like, burlap sticking everywhere. But I think burlap pillows are really cute. I just sewed this heart on. But instead of a heart, you can also sew anything else you want, like a letter or a pic another shape if you want and um, to learn how to make this you can click this box right here um, and that is all of my ideas thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed the ideas I gave to you today and um, if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel right there Alice Craft Creations and my other channel that I just made the creative square which is right there and you can just click those to bring you to my channels and I really hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time. Bye!